The gift of giving Merry Christmas comes with far more than wrapping paper and a bow. No worries, you take your time. Merry Christmas. The gift of giving A lot of people come on Christmas Eve, yes. is far bigger than anything that can fit in a box beneath a tree. I think they're going to feel a huge sense of relief, uh, gratitude, um, freedom. Uh, I think it's going to be amazing. A celebration, hopefully, for them. Inside the Orchard Church in Brighton. With no strings attached. Christmas Eve service comes with a lesson in gratitude. We donated $15,000 to pay our debt. And a sermon on generosity. We're just doing it to help. We're doing it because we believe that the reason we exist is because God gave to us. That's what Christmas is all about. The church paid off $1.5 million worth of medical debt for people across the Rocky Mountain region. Buying the debt for a fraction of the price, the gift will give 1,000 low-income families a fresh start from the debt they had built up. It's pretty awesome. It, it makes me feel privileged and honored to be a part of a church that wants to give back and wants to make a difference. On a day when we hold our breath to find out what presents are left for us. Giving is fun. A gift perhaps more valuable won't be waiting under the tree. Merry Christmas. The gift of giving. You're welcome. And the people who will have this debt paid off will be notified sometime over the next couple of weeks through the mail. That means most of them still don't know that they've been chosen. The church says the recipients are picked randomly, but are those who are most in need. Alex. That is so incredible. I think when you give tithes and offerings to a church, that's where you want to cool. see your money going. Pretty cool. It brings a smile. Oh, Mark, thank you.